Hello once again and welcome back to Persona 5 Royal. Let's call Kawakami. Oh. Hi. Ah, she's out of the hospital and okay. Uh, does your room need cleaning? I would like to request you. Hey. I'll head over right now. Come on over, Kawakami. I actually really like the antique feel of this room. Don't lie, but I have to say goodbye to it today. Um... The thing is, I've decided to quit. My boss found me a part-time job that pays better than this one. Takase-kun's guardians keep increasing their demands. So this is just what I have to do. Is this really what you want? What I want? Takase-kun's guardians say the only true way to apologize to Takase-kun is by paying them. If that's not true, then what's the right thing to do here? I wonder if I can escape all this if I quit being a teacher. People like me have no right being a teacher. If I quit on my own, I won't have to pay them. That's why I'm going to quit both my teaching job and my maid job. What do you think? No, don't run away. <laughs> Another scolding, huh? But you're right. I'm just running away. Now that I think about it, it's too late for me to stop being a teacher. If I really felt bad for what happened, I would have resigned the day he died. And yet, I still felt the need to teach. I wonder why I feel that way even now. Hmm, let's go with, that's your answer. I'm a Mia-kun. Oh, that's right. I decided the way to apologize to him was to make sure there won't ever be another student like him. Because I might have been able to save him if I hadn't been afraid of rumors or labels back then. If I wanted to become a teacher who takes care of her students, that's the mindset I had. But now, I spend all my free time at part-time jobs, just so I can continue working as a teacher. I put the critical work of a teacher on the back burner, so I could make apology money. That's where it all went wrong. I can't make things right with Takazikun like this. Mistakes can be fixed. I'll be the teacher I aspire to be. That's the right way for me to make amends to Takazikun. From here on, I refuse to pay them any more money. And that is my answer. Well, what do you think? That's the right choice. You're right. You can't get the right answer from someone else. It can only be found from within. I learned that from you. In a way, you're my teacher. <laughs> Just kidding. Temperance rank 8. I've been so worried about making money that I haven't been paying attention to my students. Especially to you. I averted my eyes from you because you were labeled. Just like Takase-kun was. But from now on, I'm going to protect you too. As your teacher, I will never betray you. I'm going to protect you too, Kawakami. That kind of line only works from someone old enough to handle his own household chores. But thanks. I'll speak with the Takases. I'm not going to run anymore. Everything should be fine as long as I talk to them face to face. Alright, it's time for me to go. Thanks. See you later. Good night. Okay, that wasn't what I expected. Maybe it'll be the next time we hang out with her. Oh, is this Master? Thank you so much for today. Oh wait, I was supposed to stop working as Becky by today. To be honest, I always kind of knew in my heart I couldn't go on like this forever. But I felt so stuck facing it alone. It's thanks to you that I fi actually figured out what I need to do. Hmm. This seems arrogant. This seems like coming on too strong. Uh, 
I don't know. Sometimes Persona likes those like really forward answers. Let's go for it. Yeah, it worked out. Come on, you realize you can't feed me lines like that anymore. But I haven't given you any proper appreciation yet, so thank you, really. Get to bed early tonight. Lack of sleep is basically poison for your body and mine, okay? Good night. Ooh, cop sirens. Did something happen? Is someone turning themselves in? Actually, why are there, like, police sirens? Does it have anything to do with what's about to happen in the story? Who knows? And already our percentage has gone up. Fantastic. I heard they caught some criminal. People are saying it was foretold by a calling card. Oh, I know about that. I saw them in Shibuya. The, that Phantom Thieves forum is super active. There's a forum? What's it called? I want to see. Oh man. It's so hot. Who cares? Did you catch the news report this morning about the mafia boss getting busted? Apparently someone scattered calling cards all across Shibuya just before his arrest. Remember the Kamashita scandal? They say the same thing happened that someone left a calling card. Matarame too if I'm not mistaken. Do you think it's the Phantom Thieves? If so, I'm impressed. I can't believe they actually steal hearts. No matter how hard they looked, even our organized crime department couldn't catch Junya Kanashiro. And yet he simply turned himself in. Even confessed all his crimes. <sighs> the Phantom Thieves. Is it a crime to manipulate someone's heart? Depending on the means, yes. He's absolutely right. Even if it makes someone admit their evil deeds and helps make them pay for their crimes? I hope she hasn't fallen under their influence. <sighs> Too late for that. The Phantom Thieves. Damn it. Why are you so mad? Now everyone. I the leader of the crime ring that was causing trouble in Shibuya got caught. Seems like some of our students had been victimized by them, so we can breathe easy for now. I'm thankful to the police for arresting the perp, even though they're just doing their job. By the way, perp is police slang. You might have heard the stars and police procedurals say it. It's short for perpetrator. Speaking of stars, can you answer this question, Amiya-san? Give me an answer. The sum of angles, a through A through E. Okay, they should have capitalized those, as well as in the diagram. It would have been more clear. Is ah, oh, god damn it. <laughs> is the same as the sum of interior angles of a certain shape of 180 degrees. Do you know what that shape is? Uh, it's a pentagon? Hmm. Ah, it's a trick question. The sum of uh, interior angles of a triangle will always equal 180 degrees when, when it is planar. Ah, he wouldn't get it right. It's almost like he hasn't taken geometry in like a, over a decade. I remember their name with that bit on Madarame. Now, yeah, stop talking about the Phantom Thieves. Still your heart for asking me hard geometry questions. Amamiya-kun, please go to the student guidance office. Amamiya-kun, please come to the student guidance office. Hey! That sounded like Kawakami. I wonder what's up. Sorry. Sorry to pull you out of class, but it's about Takase-kun's guardians. I told them that I'm not going to pay them any more money. I'm quitting my part-time job too, although I'm still in talks with my boss about it. I'm going to devote myself to being a great teacher. No matter what others say, I won't waver. So thank you for giving me such good advice. I just thought you should be the first to know. Miss Kawakami, you have guessed. The Takases are here. Dun dun dun! What? 
They're here? At school? What amazing timing. How long are you going to make us wait? Him again. <laughs> We're talking here. How rude. I guess a student is only as good as his teacher. Obviously, you lack a proper education. You thought you could just call and say you're not going to pay anymore? Who do you think you are? You know... It's what I decided, for Takasakun's sake. I'm going to make sure there won't be any more students like him who... So you're just trying to get out of your responsibility? I bet you don't even care about Taiki. How are you still a teacher? Maybe we really should sue the Board of Education. Are you okay with that? A teacher who caused her student to die would surely cause a scandal. I'm not going to run or hide. I'm going to spend my time taking care of my students. If you want to take legal action, then go ahead. Regardless, I'll continue teaching. I've decided that's the best apology I can make to Takasekun. Paying money to you two is not the solution, to say the least. Along with suing you, maybe I should tell everyone about your little secret. You know, about your little stint as a sex worker. What? How did you- Oh, so I'm right, am I? What? I mean, the amount of money you're paying us can't come from just a teacher's salary. Well, shall we head on over to the faculty office? Stop, please. Ha, huh, a teacher working in the sex industry? You've definitely done it this time. How unfortunate for you that you thought you could just leave Taiki's matter unsettled. You know what you have to do now, right? Pay up, and don't ever call us again with this garbage about stopping the payments. Uh. I guess I can't quit my part-time job just yet. You can't give up. I know, but what am I supposed to do? What about the Phantom Thieves? Would they even help someone like me? No, that's impossible. <laughs> Kawakami appears to be deeply hurting. I need to do something for Kawakami. I can't do this anymore. What are their names again? Who, the Takases? The husband is Toshio-san and his wife is Hiromi-san. <laughs> I could never forget them. I send them money every week. Wait, why? You don't intend on doing something, do you? Please don't. A Shujin teacher asking the Phantom Thieves for help would be... I'm sorry. I was so excited to tell you what I had decided. Then it ended up like this. Just forget everything, okay? If you think about it, I'm right back where I started. I guess I'll never be able to change. Yeah. Class is about to start. I need to go. <sighs> I need to do something about the targets for Kawakami. A teacher made to suffer. There's the request we wanted. Among others, but that's that one's really important. Hell yeah! Kanashiro finally confessed! People have been making a huge deal of it since the police announcement. It's difficult to accept that the authorities are taking all of the credit for his arrest. People are going nuts about the Phantom Thieves online, though. Look! It's all coming together for us. Oh, this is quite the turnaround. All of a sudden, people are expressing their long-standing belief in us. So this is why Makoto told us to post the calling card anywhere that might stand out. Pretty smart move on her part. Oh, where is our amazing Miss President? It's Makoto. My apologies, but I, I won't be able to join you today. I've been called into a meeting with the principal. There's no need to worry, though. More importantly, there is a special on TV about the Phantom Thieves. Huh? What did it say? They were talking all about our calling cards. For real? Anyway, my apologies about today. I'll have to see you all another time. Who is that? Really? Oh, that's freaking crazy! 
I hope all this excitement doesn't place us in the police's radar. It'll be fine! No way they'd find out about that weird other world. True, but do you remember what the fake Kaneshiro said towards the end? Yeah, he said we're not the only ones who are doing it. Eh, not gonna let it bother me. As far as we know, he was just pulling that shit out of his ass. I hope that's the case. Anyways, in your face, Akechi. Now what do you want to do about our next target? Don't get ahead of yourself. Still, people might expect a lot from our next move considering how excited they're getting. We can't just pick any old schmo now. There is no need to hurry though. Counting Kamoshida, we've claimed three consecutive victories, right? We should just lay low and wait for all this excitement to blow over. In that case, how about we have another celebration? Oh, good idea! We can make it a welcoming party for Miss President, too! By the way, that briefcase, it's pretty damn expensive! Let's sell it and drop the cash on our party! Wow. Seems like the lay low and wait idea has gone completely out the window. So we can count you out then, Morgana? Uh, what are you talking about? I was just saying we should try and keep our party on the down low. <laughs> and that's the spirit! Well, I'm gonna let Makoto know. Hi, Makoto. There's something we forgot to tell you. So... Oh... What's wrong? Hello? I hope you remember we have finals next week. Yusuke and Morgana excluded, of course. If you wish not to stand out, you had best not get bad grades, okay? That is something I simply would not be able to overlook as student council president. For now, behave and concentrate on your studies. We can have fun once finals are over. Understood? Care to explain? I believe in what I wrote. The Phantom Thieves are just. Have you figured out who they are? No, I'm nowhere close. However, after considering all the facts, I concluded there are no errors in their acts or principles. Thus, upon deeming them to be on the side of justice, I have decided to end my investigation. But that's impossible! Impossible? May I see the evidence you have that leads you to believe so? I was just speaking to the director of a prestigious college about your letter of recommendation, too. There will be no need for that. I intend on getting into a good college by my own merit. Please excuse me. Hey, we're not done here! <sighs> Sir, it's me. I apologize for bothering you like this. About that. Yes, I am making progress. <laughs> However, I have stumbled upon some difficulties. Still, why would someone as important as you be interested in a petty case like this? No, that's not what I meant. I will investigate with all the resources available to me. Of course. Um, I should be able to let you know relatively soon. Yes, I will bring good news. Uh, well then, uh, thank you for your... Damn it! I'm home. Hi, sis. You look tired. Is everything okay? Don't worry about me. How about you, Makoto? Have you been keeping up with your studies? Yes, of course. Though, what is the point of studying? What do you mean? I was just wondering what will be waiting for me at the end. Even if I manage to push through tough entrance exams, I'm still thrust into a competitive society. What else is there besides success? Don't ask me such childish questions. Isn't this the man the Phantom Thieves sent a calling card for? I heard he confessed all his crimes. Even the police couldn't figure out why. It really... was out of nowhere. This would only make sense if his personality changed. 
That would be impossible. Why does it matter? The police still caught him in the end, right? I had plans set for a promotion, but no one can take credit for his arrest now with that confession. Not that a child would understand. So she was pursuing the case after all. Promotion. You've changed, sis. But I'll be okay. I finally found a place where I belong. Ah, you're back. How are things going? You seem to be keeping on the straight and narrow so far, but... That doesn't mean you can just slack off with summer on the horizon, got it? This reaction is incredible. I'm honestly shocked to see it. It is only natural that people are surprised. Even the police were struggling to catch him. Yeah, by the way, you said you were called in by the principal? Did something happen? It was regarding my investigation of the incident with Mr. Kamashita. Don't worry, I didn't mention a word about any of you. I essentially told him I was unable to find any information. Are you going to be okay? I will. I've graduated from my role as the exemplary honor student. From now on, I'm going to be more honest with myself. A quite refreshing feeling. What are you going to do now? Want to stay with the Phantom Thieves? That's my intention, assuming it wouldn't be any trouble. Welcome aboard. It'd actually be a big problem if you didn't stick with us. We should allow her to join us. It would be greatly convenient. Well then, I hope I can continue getting along with all of you. An advisor, huh? This new teammate of ours is pretty promising. We'll be able to do even more now! I don't like that conversation. It's, it feels out of place. Like, was it ever really in doubt that Makoto was in for the long haul? Like, the second she got her persona, like, she was, like, in there. It was not... There's nothing temporary feeling about it. Hello. <laughs> hey, good evening. How about, uh, how about we worry about that a little later? Kanashiro, the suspect in the case, is the leader of a crime ring in Shibuya. Many people are surprised that such a major criminal was suddenly arrested. Police are also reasserting their stance that the Phantom Thieves weren't involved in the arrest. However, some outlets are reporting otherwise. The police should just be honest. Why play dumb? Well, it's not like they can even prove it. Pretty healthy. No wine. No Kawakami. Because we have to uh, do her request. Catchy. Cheerful fortune teller. Oh, we're totally hanging out with Akechi. Or with... Or Hifumi, rather. We haven't uh, started Hifumi's. Um, hers has always been blank like that, right? Because we haven't actually started her thing. Let's go to the Velvet Room first, actually. Hey, inmate. Back to our prison we go. You certainly seem composed. You wish that I do. Alright, let's do a little fusion here. Actually, wait. I am so dumb. What? I'm so dumb that I forgot what I'm actually supposed to do. What? Uh, penal labor. <laughs> we have to make Satanta with Raku Kaja. Huh? Okay, got it. Okay, so I set this up to where I could do the fusion. I just forgot what it had to be. I forgot the skill. We want Suzaku and Phoenix. You okay with this? Select the you'd like to inherit. Uh, which one of these do we want to keep? Do I even have? No, I don't. Do I have counter? No. Uh, I guess we're taking crisis control. There it is. All right, that's all we needed. Um, well, let's put Dodge Scion since he has a weakness to it. Generate. It will receive a fraction of time. Girls, let us begin. Oh my god, are you for real? Holy shit, that's unlucky. Are you for fucking real? I got an accident on a persona I needed? 
Oh, and I got Principality. I already have Principality. This is bullshit. What the oh fuck? Why does this game hate me? What? what the hell? That's bullshit. That's so bullshit that we're gonna pause this video and I'm gonna reload this file and fast forward back to where I just was so that doesn't happen again. Holy shit. That's so unlucky. I've never seen that happen. Ugh. What the hell, Persona 5? Alright, and I'm back. Well, that shaved a little bit of time off the playthrough. My god, what a pain in the ass. And this time I remember to save before doing that. Ugh. That was the worst. Uh, no, that's not what I picked. I wanted Crisis Control. What do we pick again? Meteorama. Uh, It will receive a fraction of power. It will receive a fraction of power. Now, what did I change? Let's go with Dodge Side. It will receive a fraction. My, my. Thank you for not screwing me this time. This is also the level 25 Emperor we were missing by pure coincidence. Thank you. Been done already? What? What? Huh. It would seem. See? You can do it. There we go. Amazing, huh? You know, I never thought you'd keep at this even with, even though it's not mandatory. Huh, you're a pretty interesting inmate. I must say, as Carolee noted before, this list is quite well thought out. The tasks are designed to push you toward achieving your goals, also measuring your true strength. Hmm, I guess so. Hey, inmate! What are your thoughts on these tasks? Uh... They're perfect. Oh, you've got guts in meat. Oh well. We should give him the next one. Let's see here. Huh? What the? Feels like I've seen the writing on this list before. Do you speak of the penmanship? Yeah, damn it. Can't remember. Do you recognize it you've seen? Compliment him after he finished the next task. Don't spoil him, though. Do it just like you practice with a piercing glare and angled hips. Wait, not that. Those are my notes. Uh, I, no, I mean... It seems you have been rather looking forward to the inmates' visits. Never mind that. I'm talking about the handwriting of the tasks themselves. Stop yanking my chain. Hmm. Now that you mention it, I do feel as though I've seen that handwriting somewhere before. Can I see? Excuse me? Keep your nose out of other people's business, inmate. <sighs> to be honest, the sense of deja vu I feel when reading this list is certainly concerning to me. Who made this list? And why? What do you mean? The goal is pretty obvious. It's to help train the inmate. Beyond that, though, what exactly is the purpose of training him? Rehabilitation? But that is merely our master's order. Someone other than him wrote this list, correct? <sighs> then let's just assume there's some purpose we don't know about. If we're right in our assumption, the purpose will be clear once he finishes the whole list, right? That is correct. I suppose you have a point. Hearing something logical from you is like a cool rush of air amidst the sweltering heat of summer. Hmm. You didn't need to say that. Now then, let us reward you for successfully completing our task. We will now grant you access to the special treatment. We hereby permit you to create personas you wouldn't normally be able to handle. But the catch is, you'll still have to pay the price for it. Make sure you use this to the fullest so your rehabilitation comes to fruition. Do not disappoint us. I feel like my bond with Caroline and Justine is growing deeper. 
Strength Rank 5 allows you to pay a lot of money to create personas of a higher level. Wasn't this their Rank 10 skill? Am I nuts? Did I just forget what level you got this at in Vanilla P5? I thought this was their max rank ability. If they change this to 5, then holy shit! Also, I have a ton of money, so I can just break this game to all hell now. All right. Awesome. Now then, allow me to give you your next assignment. Please note that the next privilege we provide you will be quite powerful indeed. Therefore, you, we will require that you complete three tasks before you can receive it. <laughs> Alright, here's task number one. Now. Your next assignment is an Echo Shogun with the skill Dekaha. You only need to speak with us once. Once you obtain it, we will be able to tell. Huh. See if you can live up to our expectations. <laughs> Take that! I already had it! Cheats! Hmm. <laughs> You're really getting the hang of this whole growth thing. <sighs> What's wrong, Justine? It is nothing vital. However, presiding over the growth of another feels almost nostalgic in a way. Do you feel the same, Caroline? What do you mean? We've never taken care of someone like this before. You are not wrong about that. And yet, our duty to aid his rehabilitation aside, observing his growth feels oddly familiar. Excuse me? That can't be right. The inmate's growth and this rehabilitation are the exact same thing. Hey, inmate! The growth you're getting from these tasks is helping with your rehabilitation, right? I don't know. Eh, you probably just don't realize it yet. You have a totally different air about you now. Anyway, Justine, don't forget about our job. The duty we've been handed is all that matters. Don't think about anything else. Yes. I suppose you are correct. <sighs> I guess you're gonna keep worrying about this till the inmate finishes his rehabilitation, huh? Look what you've done, inmate. Getting us all wrapped up in your fate. Ugh. Could it be? What's wrong? Nothing. But I believe I am beginning to look forward to seeing whether the inmate can complete his task. You heard her. Don't disappoint us, inmate. Strength rank 6. Okay, on to the next task. Justine? Farewell. Yes, here's the second task for gaining the next privilege that we will grant you. We would like you to harbor a Lachesis with the skill Tetraha within you. You only need to speak with us once you obtain it. Okay. Okay, that one I don't have. <laughs> Let's do it. That's that one's too hard. Oh, I should register them. Do you have business with me? You'd like to read the compendium? Oh. Nothing changed. Oh right, I already I did finished. it off camera. What? Neat. It is time, inmate. I believe, like, I was looking at the list and I was like, Lachesis, that's too high level for me now, but now that I have that rank 5 ability, I guess it's not. Not that I know how to do it off the top of my head. I'll worry about that some other time. Okay, what's it gonna be? Akechi or Hifumi? I'm kind of leaning towards Hifumi. I feel like we should start it. Why not? That girl's playing Chogi. Maybe she's Hifumi Togo, the one Yusuke mentioned. Why don't you go ask her? Togo-san? What? Um, yes? My overflowing charm seems to have reached Hifumi. I wonder if I needed rank 4 to do this anyway. Huh. That might have been really good timing. I'm Hifumi Togo. Playing Chogi by yourself? I'm doing some research, so... 
experimenting with new tactics is best to do alone in a place like this. Well, I suppose that doesn't sound terribly possible to someone who doesn't play. Don't mind me. Please go ahead and pray. Ifumi Togo seems to take a very tactical approach to playing Shogi. I feel like I can learn some tactics for the Phantom Thieves from her Shogi expertise. I should ask her if she'll teach me. Hell yeah. Ifumi's cool, I like her. Yes? Can I help you? Can you teach me Shogi? Huh? Um... You don't necessarily have to learn from me, you know. There are other options, such as playing online. Sorry, I just can't. Well then... Um, so... You like Shogi? I want to play like you. Like me? You're a bit strange, but... Thank you. Um. Okay, just a quick game then. 20 seconds per move, if that's alright with you. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, that thing that will likely make her lose interest. I'll just move the pieces okay. randomly. <laughs> oh, Joker's great. So this is your skill level, huh? The dragon which governs the blue sky has fallen into my hands. How do you intend to survive this? Check. <laughs> it's checkmate, no matter how you look at it. Please concede. No, I can, I can still keep going. To concede is an act of admitting that you have lost with grace. If you aspire to become a shogi player, I recommend that you take your study of the game to heart. Aww. Thank you for playing. Well then, that will be all for today. If it's all right with you, may I request another match sometime? I feel a gambler's spirit emanating from you, which is strange, since your style of play is that of a complete novice. I'm a beginner. Huh? Oh, I'm sorry. However, I will instruct you under one condition. You become my playing partner so that I can research new moves. Is that agreeable? Sounds good to me. Thank you very much. Well then, it's a deal. I'll teach you how to play, and you'll assist me with my new moves. I've made a deal with Hifumi. That was really easy. The Phantom Thieves were exceptionally good at Shogi. Who taught you? Where did you learn how to play Shogi so well? I think that quite advanced strategies are necessary to succeed at that many criminal acts. And yours weren't by the wit of an amateur. You had a professional who regularly deals with such tactics. You have an idea on who that is, don't you? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the star persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. The star, rank one. Koma Sabaki allows you to swap current party members with backup members during Joker's turn. That's already an excellent skill. All right. Okay, let's end here for today. Yeah, that's the other reason why I wanted to do this. She gives you knowledge too, though it's just one point. Thank you for today. Oh, I think this part's new. Oh, I'm a Mia-san. I'd like to thank you once again for today. Before you head home, would you like to exchange IDs with me? There's no obligation, of course. Sure thing. Thank you. All right, then. Let's see. Ah, uh, yes, it went through. Until next time. I'll let you know if I come up with any new strategies. 
Oh, that was weird. Did you see Joker like load in there? Also, like none for nothing. Maybe I'm crazy here, but like Hifumi is made to jump into 4K really well compared to other characters. She looks really pretty. <laughs> be ridiculous this new ally you gained was makoto <laughs> were we supposed to not tell her any names <laughs> just tell me the truth you already know the truth makoto that's preposterous if what you say is true was makoto also running from the police when you were arrested <laughs> Maybe. Now that I think about it, she did start talking a lot about the investigation from summer onward. <sighs> Makoto aside, you mentioned one other important detail. Did Kanashiro really say there was someone using the metaverse besides the Phantom Thieves? Those words could just be taken as you shifting blame to this other person, you know. But why would you fabricate such an elaborate story and then shift the blame elsewhere? There are two possibilities. Either you've simply been trying to confuse me with your lies, or everything you've stated is true. Have you been telling me the truth from the very start? Excellent writing, Atlas. There are two possibilities. Either you're telling me the truth or you're lying. <laughs> well, obviously. That's the plan. Then again, I am investigating a thief who steals hearts. Very well. No matter how absurd it may seem, I'll reevaluate my stance on believing you, for now. In return, speak the whole truth and nothing but the truth. It's a fair deal. Is that acceptable? Ah, oh, this is when it happens. I've made a deal with Sai Nishima. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Judgment Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Judgment, rank one. Yeah, this was super hyped the first time I played the game in Japanese when uh, they had not uh, disclosed what the Judgment Confidant was. So when this happened, it was like, oh shit. We're running out of time. Let's move on to your next target. Actually, I should rephrase that. They targeted your group first, didn't they? The identity of your opponent is this. We have no pictures. Even their names and identities are unknown. If what you told me is true, then this nav thing you've mentioned wouldn't have worked in this case. How did you target them? Tell me everything. At Medjed. Who has the Medjed Twitter handle? I don't know. I hope they're not a dick. Yes, fuck the Mafia. Well said, Anon. Hey, you're there, right? Come downstairs. Hey, check the ingredients in the fridge. Hey, what's up? Huh? It's not right? Not cute. That was the one the staff recommended to me, though. Won't that printer do? Huh? It'll do, but it's not it. Okay, I'll be right over. <sighs> this might take a while. I'm leaving this door to you. Lock up for me if I don't come back. Got it. I owe you one. <laughs> what a handful. Always the ladies' man, Sojiro. Look at him go, look at that pimp walk. And that concludes the latest news on the suspect Kanashiro. This case is said to be a result of the Phantom Thieves' actions, but what do you think? We don't know their methods, but I believe they are a menace that will threaten this law-abiding country. 
This dangerous group tampers with people's hearts. It's no different from brainwashing. I see. You're absolutely correct. I wonder what's going on. Didn't this happen a little while ago, too? Who was it again? You know, that famous artist. Ah, Madarame, was it? They punished those awful people, didn't they? The Phantom Thieves aren't at fault, then. Well, that may be true, but... Don't you think so, too, dearie? The Phantom Thieves aren't doing anything wrong, are they? Of course not. See, even he says that they're doing good. Oh my, look at the time. We should probably head home. Ah, you're right. Thanks for the drink. Yes, I've received the reports on Kaneshiro's case. But to think the Phantom Thieves would honestly attempt an absurd idea like social reform. You're absolutely right. I'm not pleased about the general public support of them either. There's also the danger of the Metaverse being exposed with their continued actions. Actually, there is one countermeasure he brought in that seems usable. It involves having the Phantom Thieves destroy themselves without our direct intervention. We'll set things up so that those mental shutdown occurrences are their doing. Ah, I thought as much. I had a feeling that it was too brutal for it to be his own idea. Still, to think you'd go through such elaborate detail to crush them. Their actions must be that much of an eyesore for you. I sympathize with what you're going through. Well then, we'll clean this up quickly and put it behind us. Yes, a grand undertaking like social reform is beyond a group such as the Phantom Thieves. Only a select few are worthy of changing the world. And who better than the future Prime Minister, sir? <laughs> Man! We should probably talk about that later. It's Ryuji. What you doing? You know, just bonking. Watching the store. Gotcha. We're gonna come over right now about the, uh, you know what. See ya. What's up? We're here to hang out. Here to bonk. That's not why we're here. We need to study for finals. <sighs> why am I here too? You're one of us now, so of course you gotta help us. We're in trouble if you don't teach us, you know. Uh, that's right. Even you're saying such things? Let's leave those guys be. Hey, my knowledge is only a three. <sighs> I couldn't ask the last time I was here, but what is this place? The storekeeper doesn't seem to be around. It's where this guy lives. He's got complicated circumstances. We can tell her about it, right? Actually, tell yourself. That's... that's terrible. On Yusuke and me are pretty much the same too. I mean, it's not as bad as this guy's though. It's just something we can't ever put up with. That's why we all became Phantom Thieves. Hey, don't forget me! I know, I know. We're all part of the team. By the way, Makoto, ain't there someone you can't forgive either? Like, a heart you want to change? That's the secret. Ah, there's someone like that. You could just tell us, you know. You don't gotta be so cold. That aside, do you have any intention of studying for the exams? Not really. It's fine if I leave then? No, no, I I'm just joking. P please teach us. Phobia, so it's a fear of some kind. I think it's a fear of open spaces. You don't hear it that often, though. Leave vocabulary and long sentences to me. I suck at proper grammar, though. Duh, even if we study English, it's not like I'm gonna use it in the future. <laughs> when it comes to you, your Japanese is questionable, too. 
Don't think about it too uh, hard. Shut up! Explain the writer's feelings? What point is there in that? Oh, it's impossible. I can't memorize all these formulas. Ain't there a good way of cheating? Why don't we take a break? And that was the follow-up report on the suspect Kaneshiro. Now, Akechi-san. This case is said to be the result of the Phantom Thieves' actions, but in actuality, is this true? Considering how a calling card was scattered about, I believe there's no mistaking that. The question is what the Phantom Thieves actually did. If they tampered with the suspect's heart, it casts doubt on the authenticity of any confession. So then by tampering with hearts, the Phantom Thieves are fabricating crimes that may not exist? We can't deny the possibility. There's no doubt that the Phantom Thieves are exposing hidden injustices in society. However, if this is done by sidestepping the law, their way of thinking is very dangerous. So, in a way, they're outlaws? Yes. They're no different than the criminals they target. This cannot be overlooked. I see. Oh, I see. My ass! Why the hell are we being treated as the bad guys? Just let them say whatever they want. More people are starting to understand that what we're doing is right, after all. When I'm walking around in town, I hear a lot more people talking about us, too. And the forum's been full of hype. Do you think we made it big time? Don't get pompous over dealing with some street thug. Save it for after we deal with a bigger target. We just gotta take down a bigger one, yeah? That was the plan from the start anyways. True. It may be best if we start thinking about it. I bet we'll find one in no time. The wind's blowing in our direction and everything. I feel like we won't lose to anything right now. Well, we'll decide on that eventually. We need to overcome our exams first. Now then, break time's over. Let's get back to... That reminds me! The celebration party! Weren't we gonna do it after exams? Yes, I believe so. Where should we go? I feel like I'll study better if I got something to look forward to. The last one was a buffet at a hotel. We haven't gone anywhere since. Hmm? A buffet? Where would be good? Hey, what about fireworks? A fireworks festival! Oh yeah, it's that season, huh? <laughs> that sounds good to me. It's hard to ignore a buffet, but I'll take the beauties of summer. Still, I demand that we feast during the festival as well. Do you guys own a yukata? Will you wear a yukata? Doesn't a fireworks festival sound good? Uh, you think so too, right? It's a great idea. All right, fireworks festival it is. Let's look for a good one. Study comes first, though. I won't let you off if you fail any of them. Are we clear? Yes, ma'am. All right, fireworks festival it is. Let's look for a good one. Study comes first, though. I won't let you off if you fail any of them. Are we clear? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Fireworks and Yukatas. Guess it's that time of year. Hey, so there's this dangerous, almost psychotic blog I found that hasn't ended up on the forum yet. I'll kill him, I'll kill him, I'll kill him. That's all it says. Remember has it? She's talking about her boyfriend. Eh, it's fine. <laughs> no, no, no. Sounds dangerous. Yeah, it seems like she'll do something real bad someday, right? You know, like, like kill him. That could be bad. And it gets even worse. As it turns out, she's a Shujin student. You know a girl named Yumiko Mogami? She's always up near the classrooms on the second floor. Please, you have to do something before things get worse. Sure thing. The lovesick cyber stalking girl. Request. We got any messages? Uh, nope. Can I like do a thing tonight? Yeah, I can. Uh, what should we do? Uh, 
Let's check TV first. Now, an update on the arrest of Kaneshiro, suspected mafia and scam ringleader. Just before his arrest, calling cards with the suspect's name were posted all over the area. Pictures of these were spread on the internet. Some claim these are proof that the Phantom Thieves exist. Hmm. Putting calling cards up all over town is really effective. Getting famous might keep us pretty busy. Right? So I can't leave. <laughs> we are not going to sleep. Let's study. Now what do you want to do? Study. Make sure your clothes up. Probably not going to rank up, but you never know. Hey, hey. We got a few days before exams. We could get lucky. <laughs> Unfortunately, because we didn't get to go out, we missed out on Alchiru too. What are people talking about? Oh, it's the Phantom Thieves. They're stealing hearts. Oh my god. Monday the 11th. <sighs> what a refreshing morning. How are you doing? I didn't expect the Phantom Thieves would suppress a man that even the police had trouble with. The fact they have so much support online is worrisome. I'm in a bind since I previously denounced them. All the interviews these days ask me about that. Still, can we really say the Phantom Thieves are on the side of justice with just this example? Let people talk. <laughs> oh, thank you. But I noticed that you're not saying that the Phantom Thieves are right. I suppose that was an unfair way to phrase it. I was originally investigating the mental shutdown incidents. Don't you think it's similar to the change of heart that the Phantom Thieves are doing? Hmm. Now that I think about it, their actions mirror the mental shutdown cases with the rate of victims. It's impossible not to see a connection there. Ah, sorry. I don't want to make you late. I'll see you again. That's worrying, isn't it? <sighs> it's even more packed than usual today. Now for today's train news. Today's headlines are Shibuya crime ring reveals all. The leader's confession has led to the arrest of other key members. Sudden rampage highway accident? The driver's death has been confirmed, taking the total count up to four. Hotspots of Tokyo, come see the summer fireworks show on July 18th. That's a week away. I see. Thanks to Kanashiro spilling the beans, that organization is falling like a house of cards. Heh, <laughs> we're getting more and more famous. Gonna be a busy day at school, isn't it? Oh, Maruki. Okay, let's get started. Tests are coming up. Everyone's studying. I know some of you rely on all-nighters, but I can't recommend it. That really messes up your information retention. Oh, speaking of, do you guys know the difference between short-term and long-term memory? Hmm. The simple answer is that short-term memory is more temporary, contextual, but long-term memory stick with you. In the short term, you're working with a hard limit. You retain only six, maybe seven pieces of information. But your brain's capacity for long-term memory is huge. It might even be infinite, according to some theories. How about you? Okay, so, I'm a Miyakun. What do you think about all this? Short-term memories only stick with you for seconds at a time. That said, how long do you think you can retain long-term memories? Um... So he wants to know how long you keep long-term memories, huh? This is a tricky one. What is a long-term memory and what is long-term memory anyway? Uh, is this one of those, like, answered in phases things? Hmm. Memories that last a long time. Yeah, it was something like that. So anyway, keep them for, mo for a long time. The question is how long? Rookie mentioned something about the amount of memories you can store, right? Something like... Infinite. Yeah. If you have theoretically infinite space for them, then theoretically you'd be able to retain them for... Forever. Yeah, I think so too. That was really easy. This is it. That's right. I'm impressed. Basically, stuff encoded into your long-term memory never really goes away. Short-term memories become long-term memories through re reiteration. It'd be great if you could encode all the test answers to long-term memory, huh? Oh well, can't always get what you want. Oh, he's so smart. He figured out like the easiest question ever. But at least you've got summer break once exams are over. So do your best to study, okay? 
Yeah, memories never really go away. That means I'll remember my my past eventually, right? Aw, oh, Mona. Seven eighteen, Marine Day. Final scene on the sixteenth, so that should be good, right? What are you talking about? The fireworks festival. You're really quick to look up stuff like that. Impressive, Ryuji. It's easier to work when you got a goal in mind, yeah? Hey, we're in the middle of class. Talk about those things later. Yeah, yeah. Hey, are you listening? Uh oh. You pay attention. Is that how you listen when someone talks to you? Film murderous intent. Uh oh. Hey, I dodged it again. I didn't need to rank up. What an epic dodge. Can't believe he dodged Ushimaru's throw. See it, ninja? Hey! I'll take that two charm points. I'm gonna hit five before you know it. Hey! Oh my god, I wasn't expecting this. Alright, let's stop here. When we pick up next time, we will continue on with this conversation and we'll talk a little bit about the story of the game assuming I remember hopefully I remember and uh, press onwards don't know if we're gonna hit that knowledge rank up before exams but we might never know see you guys in the next one